Okay guys, it's been 24 hours since I applied the first layer of refractory, so I'm going to go over to my parents' house right now, and if it's dry, then I will do the second layer. Alright guys, so for this you're going to need two and a half packs of the 8 ounce refractory cement from your kit. Um, you're going to have a full pack left over, but that's for uh, just touch-ups down the road. All right, so I had pre-measured the water, uh, 5.53 fluid ounces at first, um, but I definitely needed more water. It wasn't much. It was probably only like 0.1, you know, ounce, but um, you definitely need more. Also, again, this stuff gets real dusty, uh, so just make sure you have your mask on and, you know, gloves because it's going to get messy. All right, so just make sure you guys are mixing for five minutes. So just showing you guys like the consistency of this again, you know, you're looking for kind of like a sour cream type uh, consistency. All right, so same thing as the first coat, you know, just kind of evenly and thinly spread it everywhere. Um, just make sure you don't miss any spots, but it's just literally the same thing as the last coat. Honestly, it's pretty repetitive. Um, I flipped it over just to make sure you can get all angles and whatever. And then again, you just want to be really careful around those burner holes. So at some points, you're going to see me using my hands. I definitely think it's easier to use your fingers, especially around the burner holes and around the sides. All right, so I'm just taking the excess in the bowl and going around the burner holes, making sure it's all even, just because it's kind of lumpy. So you just want to get it real smooth. All right, so now I'm just going around those sides, you know, again with my fingers, uh, just making sure those are fully covered. So by this point, I'm literally scraping whatever's left from the bowl. Um, it was like a really perfect amount. You definitely can't make it too thick though because you won't have enough. All right, so we did it. I'm just going to show you guys uh, the inside and both sides just so you guys can see what it looks like. Um, this is 
basically it for the initial setup so um i just have to cure it still but i'll do a separate video for that all right guys so that was the second layer so we'll check back in tomorrow and see how dry it is